Alrighty, so had a little bit of a technical glitch there. Commander Shepard. But we were going to talk to Kel Kalisa Aljalani, I think Kalisa it is. Been seen in Aljilani, there you go. Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? Sure. What do you want to know? You've been given a unique position to represent our race. People want to get a sense of how you'll do that. With style. For I'm the Lord of the Dance. Hello. Humans have been trying to get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. God, that's years. bright. With that in mind, what are your feelings <laughs> on being the first human specter? Honored. The specters represent the best of every species in the galaxy. To be asked to join them is an honor. Some have said your appointment is the Citadel throwing humans a bone. Those bastards. Have you encountered any situations where the Citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? Well, honestly, no. They can be jackasses, the council but is concerned no. With the needs of the whole galactic community. We're part of that community now. Our needs are on their agenda, but we're one of many. You really do believe that, don't you? Maybe. You've been given <laughs> command of an advanced human warship for your missions. Is there anything you'd like to say about it? Well, it's multicultural. Actually, the Normandy was co-developed by human and Turian engineers. Its design incorporates many innovations, all of which are classified, I'm afraid. So there. So the Turians have knowledge of the Normandy that is being kept secret from the Alliance public? Well, no. Do you think it was appropriate to hand Earth's most advanced warship over to the Citadel? We still crew it. I wasn't aware it had been handed over to anyone. I'm in command, and last I checked, I'm human. Same goes for my crew. Unless there's human, anyone yes, in disguise. But you do work for the Citadel now, Commander. Not One really. One last question, Commander. Rumors back home say you're tracking a rogue specter named Saren. Do you have any comment on that? Well, I can't confirm nor deny. I'm afraid I can't comment on whatever my current assignment may or may not be. So there. Don't worry, we'll find out. The eyes of Earth are on you. Don't let us down. We Thank won't. Thank you for your time, Commander Shepard. We're awesome like that. How do you like that? Take down. Bet we came off as being all professional and shit. Oh yeah. Alrighty, time to look at the map. Do we have any markers? Not at the moment. Okay, uh, let's see sec officers. Let's go have a look at those. Wait, no, this isn't the sec office, is it? Where's this one? To the lower wards. Uh, no. We want to go to our right. I think. Yes. Running, running, running. Down the stairs. Wait, what? Oh, <laughs> I still ended up going the wrong way because apparently I can't read the map. Okay, where are we now? We're here. So we did want to go across this way. I was right the first time. Well, I was facing in the right direction. I was wrong, obviously. So we want to go up here. Ooh, Salarians. Has he? Well, no, uh, not exactly. But he wants to meet with me. I think he's going to kill me. Oh dear. And why do you think that? I I can't really get into the details. But Shorban will kill me if I leave here unprotected. Uh oh. Not unless you give me something more to go on. I I can't. I'm sorry. Ooh, hard decryption. Yes, please. Begin manual override. Uh, oh balls. <laughs> I think I might have not wanted to take this one. Maybe. Fuck. No. Evidently not. Alright. Override using our mini Omnigel. Helena Blake. She was last seen near the Emporium on the Presidium. That's interesting. Well, in that case, let's talk to Jaleed, see what Jaleed has to say. Hello. Hey there. Oh, you're not CSEC, are you? Did you want something? I heard words. What were you trying to explain to the officer before? Exactly. What were you trying to explain? My colleague is trying to kill me, and I thought we were friends. Kill you? How do you know he wants you dead? And why does he want you dead? He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and he started following me. Right. Okay. Yesterday, he followed me all the way home, just waiting for a chance. Or he wants to talk to you? I don't care what anyone thinks. He wants me gone. 
I know it. Okay, how can I help you? Is there something I can do? Talk to your friend, maybe? Would you? That's all I want. Someone to talk to him. Tell him to leave me alone. Okay. He thinks he can just push me around, but you'll show him, won't you? Yeah, we'll talk just to him. Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. We'll talk to him because we're oh, nice. Right. Oh, well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. Really? His name's Shorban. He's a Salarian. You shouldn't have any trouble. He's just a scientist. Well, good luck. Shorban. For some reason, I recall that name, but I can't remember why. But I am interested to see what's up here. Traffic control, it said on the map. Ooh, pretty. Tracking terminal. Oh, nothing cool. Anything over here, perhaps? No, just doors and stuff. Nothing interesting. Okay. Well, let's see what we got in the journal. We got Jaleed's fears. Person of interest to Selena Blake. Uh, about gas. More gas. Investigate somewhere in Not a Crooks. Not a, not a Crooks. Discovered a. a terrain insignias. No. Boring. Boring. Collectibles. No, thank you. Missing Marines. I thought we already did that. Uh, missing. Team. Citadel reporter's request, Emily Wong, and unusual readings. Okay, so we did the fourth estate thing. I thought there was one more that we had to do. Something about a lady who was here on the Citadel. Selena Blake, go to the system, investigate the Geth, investigate facility, find the commune, go to the Amazon system. Sorry, writings. Ah, sorry, diplomacy. Right, okay, cool. Now we need to go to the Embassy Lounge on the Presidium level of the Citadel. And find someone called Nasana. If I recall correctly, she has a part in Mass Effect 2 as well. Let us find out. So we use the fast transit system. It says she's in the embassy sector. Uh, presidium. To the embassies, please. Thank you, fast travel system. That looks cool. If you could go and actually fly through all that, that would be really awesome. But you cannot. Um, okay. So we were talking to somebody about his dead wife. Good day, Commander. Hello. The human ambassador is up the stairs, first room on the right. Um What's your name? What do you do here? Oh. My name is Sephiria. I'm the administrative assistant for the embassies. Okay, are you, you busy? seem to be distracted. The embassies are the hub of all citadel politics. <laughs> when you represent trillions of citizens, it tends to get a little busy. I should be going now. Ah. Have a pleasant day. Okay, there was a thing about his dead wife as well. So let's have a look at that one. Uh, reporter's request was interesting, but not the one we want to. Speak to Bosca. Uh, where can you have a look at the map for that? You are a Vina Embassy Lounge. Oh, they're actually in the same place, so we'll go do them both at the same time. That's handy. Open the door. Come on, door. Open. Yay, we get to tell diplomats to go shove it. I like it. Hello. My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. That's correct. Your activities you have make funky for quite lips. a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? Well, yes. Yes, yeah. there is. A man named Samesh Batya is having some trouble claiming his wife's body. It would be very much appreciated if you give it back to him. Ah, Mr. Batya. A good man in an understandably frustrating position. I wish I could help Maybe him. you can. 
Serviceman Nirali Bhatia died on Eden Prime, as Mr. Bhatia no doubt told you. Yep. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. Is that you think because her body she can't might be, dangerous be given or to him? Contaminated? No, Commander. Nirali Bhatia is not dangerous. Her body is, in fact, extremely valuable to the Alliance. A whole unit the of Marines got wiped out there. better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, Serviceman Bhatia may save hmm. more lives in death than she did in life. But a whole unit of Marines died there. You've got plenty of samples. I understand what you're trying to do, but holding the body is wrong. Give it back. Commander, you of all people should understand how far we must go to protect humanity. Yeah, and I'm still saying you're wrong. Not if we lose our humanity in the process. I'm out there fighting to stop crap like so this. So there. All right, Commander. You win. It was hard enough refusing Mr. Bhatia. I'm not going to risk an incident by refusing you. Damn straight. Tell Samesh that the body is being shipped back to Earth. I'll go now to see to it myself. Good. And I will come after you if you don't, so... I would if I were you. Now, there was a lady. And you are a strange man. Hello, Private. What do you want? What do you oh, want? Commander. What do you want, sir? Is there something I can do for you? Calm down, Private. This isn't an inspection. Might right, make it now. Sorry. What can I do for you, Commander? The consort. What can you tell me about the Asari consort? Who's I, the Asari uh, consort? Well, she's an Asari who works here as... That is, she helps people with things. Things. You never went to see her, did you? I, uh... No, I never did. Uh, I couldn't afford it. It costs half a year's credits just to go in and talk to her. Who can you is at least she? tell me where I can find her? Why am I even asking this? She's across the bridge from the embassies. Thanks, kid. Have fun. Try not to get into too much trouble. I will. Have fun, that is. Right. Anyway. Hello, Mr. Bartender. Hello, lady. I know you. You're Commander Shepard, the human specter. And you're an Asari. Is there something I can do for you? Yes. You're Nasana, right? I ran into your sister, Dahlia. It didn't end well for Stop her. your slaving. What? Are you saying she's... She is, yes. Dahlia's dead, Nasana, and I know she was blackmailing you. Hmm. And I was all set to try to manipulate you into hunting her down for me. But I guess that won't be necessary now, will it? Nope, did it already. You wanted your sister dead? If I thought ahead. If found out my sister was a criminal, I'd be considered a security risk. They'd revoke my clearance, or place me on administrative leave until she was apprehended. Those bastards. I shall transfer a little something into your account as a token of my appreciation. I'm sure you'll find the amount satisfactory. Ooh, but I've got a better deal. You're a diplomat on her way up the ranks. It could be handy to have a specter who owes you a favor. You make hmm. a good point. Anyone can come up with credits. But I can give you authorization to purchase prototype Asari mods. For what? I'll get you added to our manufacturer's preferred client list. I think you'd be very interested in what they have available. Probably, but I have no Goodbye, idea what Shepherd. it is. It has been a pleasure doing business with you. Cool. Okay, so we didn't get any money. I have no idea what we just agreed to do, but... Okay, whatever. Um... Right, so we'll go see... Mr. Barcher on the way out. Oops. We apparently can go see the Asari consort for something? I don't know. Well, we'll head over that way anyway. Asari consort. She sounds like a hoe. Yep. A prostitute. Asari prostitute. But that's not the point. Right now, we're going to go see Butcha and be like, Hey man, we got your wife's body released. Hello. Hello again, Commander. Has there been any... There has been. I reminded Mr. Bosker what we're fighting for. Your wife is coming home. So be happy. Thank you. I will return home and begin my preparations. Jolly good. It does not bring me happiness, but it may bring me peace. Goodbye, Commander. You're welcome. Bye. Smash. I don't know if this helps, but your wife, Nirali, loved you very much. I know there was a... I knew it! She I knew there was a reason that I brought her with she me. She played recordings of you every night before she went to sleep. That's nice. I know, Miss Williams. But thank you. It's nice to hear it again. <laughs> He's nice. I like him. I knew there was a reason I brought Ashley along. 
Okie dokie. So let's go over towards the consort. Why is that being so jittery? Actually, what's this? Oh, that's the CSEC. Okay, we don't need to go there. Clunk, 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 clunk. Who are you guys? Nobody interesting, apparently. More clunking. Clunk, 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 clunk. To the Citadel Towers and Wards. Nope, don't want to go there. More clunky. To Embassies and CSEC. Oh right, preachy Hannah that we helped before for whatever reason. Where there was only darkness, the gave and it was a good light. Brought to you by Power Gen. Michael Petrovsky. Hello. I don't care what you think, Michael. It's my decision. Who are these guys? You're hurting Rebecca. But don't let your grief hurt your baby too. Commander Shepard. Can I help you with domestic anything? dispute settler? Perhaps you can talk some sense into her. I don't need anyone to talk <laughs> sense into me, Michael. I'm not undergoing the treatments. Okay. My sister-in-law here is pregnant, and she's refused to let the baby undergo gene therapy in utero. Because I thought gene therapy was common. My husband Jacob died from a rare heart condition several months ago. Right. There's a chance that the baby could develop the same heart condition, but routine gene therapy can eliminate it. Okay, but there's got to be a downside small to chance, it. Michael. And extra net ah. reports say the therapy could harm the child. Right. It's less dangerous than the genetic enhancements that every soldier in the alliance receives. Okay. <laughs> what are the chances that gene therapy could hurt the baby? Very low. One in three hundred at most. But extranet articles say there could still be long-term complications we don't know about. It's, about. it's the same with everything. Don't you understand? If my baby is that one in three hundred, I will always wonder if I... If, if I killed my baby for nothing. Interesting. What are the chances that your child will develop the heart condition? According to the doctors, there's a one in fifty chance. And if my baby develops the condition, medical treatments are available. If it's detected. Which are nowhere near as effective as simply getting the gene therapy. Well, she should choose. It's Rebecca's child, Michael. I think you should honor her decision. Damn it, she's not choosing. She's acting blindly out of grief. Still had a choice to do that, though. I know you want the best for your brother's child, but this isn't your decision. Of course it is! I'm the closest thing to a father this baby is going to have. Right, so act like it. Then support the baby's mother. Stand with her when she makes tough decisions. Yeah. Good this guy, Shep. baby is the only thing my brother... It's all I have left of him. I need to know that the baby's safe. Okay. Well... It's all I have left too, Michael. You guys need to talk to I just each want other. Jacob's child to be safe. I want to give him that much. We See? Will. How easy would that have been I to promise. just say it the first time, you Thank idiots? Thank you for talking with us. I appreciate it. I didn't even mean to, so... Y you're welcome. Whatever. Hello, Solarian dude. So, Parlevon. You helped me before. Do you have any information? Greetings, Earth Clan. Hello. I believe congratulations are in order, Commander Shepard. You are the first human to join the Spectres, yes? Yes, I am. It's a great Thank you, much, Lee. One you are no doubt ready for. A word of warning, though. There are many eyes watching you now, Commander. In Some the walls. Some want to see you fail. In the walls. I, however, I'm not paranoid. wish you only nope. success. Perform well and you bring the Earth Clan one step closer to joining the Council. Right. If they let your people ah, in, I see. maybe there is hope for my own species one day, yes? Maybe. Uh, you obviously don't have any Where more information go? for me. Otherwise you would have offered it. Goodbye, Commander. Bye, Barlevon. Hang on. Helena Blake, weren't we meant to find you before? Sign, uh, it's a person of interest. Helena Blake, they seem to think she was involved in some criminal activity. Got a moment? Hello, Spectre. I have a business proposition for you. Oh. How did you know I'm a specter? Word travels. Your name comes up in certain circles. 
I'm acquainted with a pair of powerful crime bosses. Really? They're hiding on remote worlds, and I have the coordinates. You could do the galaxy a favor. What's your interest? What do you get out of this? We share interests in certain cooperative ventures. So I kill your dudes. But their business practices have forced me to terminate our relationship. Right. Once they are dead, I will manage our organization in a more tasteful manner. I see. But what did what they do? What crimes did these men commit? Specifically. They're red sand dealers who make victims of their customers. Hmm. Those who can no longer pay are sold to Batarians as slaves. Right. They're loathsome. Hurting innocent people. They must be ended. Okay. What kind of defenses would these two have? I haven't the faintest idea, but they're certain to be armed. That's not helpful. Their partnership's soured, and each believes that the other <laughs> intends to kill him. That'd be right. They will be well prepared. All right. Well, I'll help if out a little bit. As you say they are, they need to be dealt with. Where are they? Excellent. Here are the coordinates. When these men are dead, I will wait for you at the third set of coordinates. Mm, I sense a Goodbye, double cross. Commander. It's been a pleasure to meet you. Yes, quite. I sense a double cross. Hmm. Can we just go back to Normandy now, or do we have to actually walk? I think we have to actually walk. Alright, well, where's the closest rapid transit? By the consort chambers. So, over here, I think? Oh, yeah, and we were going to go talk to uh, Jaleed, or Jaleed's buddy, who he thinks is trying to kill him. And Han and Dis. I see. Uh, where's Chorban? He will meet you in the lower markets. Alright, well, we'll go there. Welcome to the Presidium. How nice. Alright, uh, we need to go to the markets, so presumably that's near the med clinic. We'll find out. Loading, loading. View of Nebula. Oh, we don't actually get to look at anything. Well, that's kind of disappointing. To the, ah, yes, to the markets in Korra's Den. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, and we were going to help out uh, this reporter lady who was around, weren't we? But I can't remember how we do that. Uh, this leads to Flux. Flux is a nightclub, isn't it? I think so. Let's find out. Ooh, you can hear the pumping beats already. Get some te 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 techno. Hello. I bring her back in a second. Sorry, I'm kind of busy right now. So, uh, what can I do? Problems? What were you discussing with the Volvas? Who, Doran? Oh, uh, I was just asking him about my sister. See, she worked for Doran before she left to. Ugh, sorry, I don't want to bore you with my problems. Yeah, nah, continue. I'm interested to hear what you have to say. Well, okay. My sister Jenna left here to go work at Cora's Den. Ah, uh, I see. The problem is, she's working as an informant for CSEC. You know, eavesdropping on the people there. Sneaky lady. If they find out what she's doing, they'll kill her. That is not Being good. Not good at all. Dangerous job. That's what I've been telling her. She didn't listen. Mm, Silly lady. Sometimes I think she stays there just to spite me. Okay, did you talk to anyone? You know who her contact at CSEC is? No. It's all very secret. Of course it is. Last time I asked an officer, he told me to stay out of it for Jenna's safety. I'll talk to her. Maybe I could help her understand just how dangerous I'm good guy Shepard. Dan is. Would you? That'd be great. Just don't tell her I sent you. Of course not. Well, I should get back to work before I get in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. It's okay. Bye. So, that's Flux. Oh, okay. So, we need to go to the actual wards before we can look at the map and see if that... Chorban, Chorban, Corban, that guy. Open the doors. 
So hopefully this unlocks our map. Nope. Need to go a little bit further. Where's that? What's ooh, what's this? Oh, okay, I see. It's on because we're on the same level as it. So hopefully once we get into here. There we go. Cool, cool. Okay. Store, lower markets, lower wards. Alright, well we want to go to the stores, so we'll go this way. Open the door. Bloop bloop. Ashley, Rapid Transit, Volus Shopper. Hello, expat. Hello, Earth Clan. No doubt you've just come back from the colonies. Will you be needing supplies? Um, sure. Show me what you've got. Sure. What have you got? Most excellent. I am sure you will find something pleasing. Well, I hope so. Hopefully, you've got something cool. Hmm. Not really. All right. Well, we can't sell anything to you anyway. <gasps> Conrad. That really? Your Commander Shepard. This guy was the awesome. Hero of Eden Prime. I am so honored to meet you. Conrad is my favorite, well, one of my favorite re recurring characters over the series because he's he's just so hilarious. But the pleasure is all mine. Nice to meet you. And you are My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than 100 Geth on Eden Prime. Well, I wasn't keeping count. I spend most of the time trying to stay alive and help the colonists. Because I'm hey, a good guy. I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Sure. Anything for a fan? Here. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. What can I say? I'm I'll awesome. Get back to work. Oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. Bye, Conrad. The fan. <laughs> been approached by him. He seems harmless. He is. He's pretty cool. But it's one of those things that, like, uh, a Bioware game just adds that little bit of extra interest by keeping this guy in there. So, who is Chop? Okay, he's Chopin. This is Morlan. Hello there. Welcome to Morlan's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? You have creepy green eyes. But yeah. Let me see what you have. Show me what you got. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. You will see. You sound like Yoda. Ooh, hang on. Yes, I will be having that, please. And I'll be having that. Uh, ooh, and now we can sell stuff. So we will sell... Uh, the pistol, the... That, 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 that. All of the really cheap stuff that we don't actually need anymore. Uh... I don't need you either. Um, don't need you, don't need you, don't need you, or you, or you. Oh. Wait, hang on. This item contains upgrades. Do you want to sell it? No. I changed my mind. This also contains upgrades. Okay. Not that one. Ah. They all contain upgrades. Uh, I have no idea what that is, so we'll sell that. Uh, don't need you, don't need you, don't need you, or you, or you, or you, or you. Yep, people. This is what happens. You get to watch me do all this selling of stuff that we don't need. Uh, yeah, I don't need you. Oh. And now we can't sell anything because we've spent so little money. That's okay. Hello, Choban.